imagine this. I am finding out that the police did a major fuck up. <laughs> and it's checkmate, bitches. Um, they set me up with uh, uh, a beautiful woman, of course, homeless. There I go being a Captain save a because she's beautiful and she's homeless. And I'm like, whoa, this beautiful woman does not belong on the street. I was like, wow, how, how is this possible? Like, wow. Anyways, yeah, that's, that's how I went into it. But at the time, I was a mess. Like CPS had taken my two daughters away, gave them to the mom and, um, I couldn't talk about my daughters without crying like a bitch. <laughs> and nobody, everybody like turning their back on me, like believing the rumors or whatever the fuck. And so I felt alone, isolated. And here she is telling me that, you know, she believes everything that I'm saying and, and believes in me. And, and even though I know in my heart that I'm innocent, you just want to hear that, you know, from anybody. I don't give a fuck if, if, if I would have paid somebody to say that to me. I would have just because it, I, I don't know. It just does everything to you, you know. But anyways, and then I, she started saying, oh, I, I started saying, well, I fucking hate the cops. I hate CPS and, I, you know, all this. And she's like, oh, yeah, me too. I fucking hate them. They're pieces of shit. Um, basically mirroring everything that I was saying. I was like, oh, yeah, I'm, you know, I'm into this and I'm into that. Oh, really? Me too. Wow. And I'm thinking in my head, wow, where, did this, where have you been all my life? Like, what the fuck? Where have you been hiding all my fucking life? You're just like perfect, a uh, perfect fit for my fucking glove. Look. Wow, where have you fucking been? Here you are perfect. Just perfect. Everything is so fucking perfect down to the fucking last detail. I never su 